Moth trapping is a very simple thing to do. A trap like this, which is quite sophisticated, but you don't need anything as ornate or as elaborate as this. Just a box or some egg cartons with a light out at night in your garden and the moths will be attracted to it. Here we've got a selection of the moths that were trapped overnight in the Museum Wildlife Garden. Here we have a species called Agrotis exclamationis, which is the heart and dart in its vernacular name. Another noctuid, the Noctua pronuba, one of the yellow underwing species. Another one which is the dark arches, Apamia monoglypha. Some species that used to be quite common, things like the garden tiger, its population levels are down something like 65% in the UK. It's now really just found around the perimeter of Britain, not in the central parts of Britain. They will suffer from things like changes in agriculture and pesticides in the garden and things like this. The general public can do a lot to help growing native species of plants in gardens or having a little corner set aside where things can survive, stopping the use of pesticides and things like that in the garden. All these sort of things can help. Mm -hmm.